Hi, everyone. My name is Pierre de Renincourt, and welcome to my course, Revit Architecture Design Development Fundamentals. I'm an AEC Curriculum Manager here at Pluralsight. In this course, we're going to learn about the various types of families we have available to us within Revit. We'll learn how to use the out-of-the-box families, as well as new and custom families, to help us further develop the design of a conceptual model. Doing so will help us create and communicate our design intent. Some of the major topics we will cover in this course include sketching generic walls, floors, and roofs, generating area and room plans, working with system families, working with curtain walls, working with loadable families, and also modeling stairs and railings. By the end of this course, you'll know how to further develop the design of a conceptual model by creating and placing new and customized loadable and system families into your Revit model. Before beginning this course, you should be familiar with the various phases of the architectural design process as well as some conceptual design fundamentals. I hope you'll join me in this journey to learn design development techniques with Revit Architecture Design Development Fundamentals at Pluralsight.